Echo TV is a co-production of Minnesota's Emergency and Community Health Outreach and TPT's Minnesota Channel. Hello, my name is Dr. Stephen Kells, and I'm here to share some important information about bed bugs. You may have heard about these insects and the harm they cause. Let's talk about some basic ways to control bed bugs if you find them in your home. First, what are bed bugs? They are small insects about the size of an apple seed. They are flat, oval, and reddish brown. They often live in places like mattresses and bedding, which is why they're called bed bugs but they can thrive in all kinds of places like furniture, backpacks, and in cracks and crevices. They feed on human blood, usually at night while we're sleeping. This can cause itchy bumps on your skin where they bite, but not everyone gets these. If you think you have bed bugs, it's important to take this seriously. Anyone's home can get bed bugs. Don't be ashamed or try to ignore it. Taking care of the problem is the only way to keep you and your family safe. The best way to get rid of bed bugs is treatment by a pest management professional. Unfortunately, this can be very expensive. If you rent your home, talk with your landlord. It is your landlord's responsibility to treat the infestation. If professional treatment is not an option, here are some tips on how to control bed bugs on your own. Controlling bed bugs without professional help is very difficult and will take a lot of time. Before we talk about how to do it, let's talk about how not to do it. Do not use any chemicals to kill bed bugs that are made for outdoor use like gardens or farming. Do not use the foggers you can buy at a store that are advertised for bed bugs. These will not kill the bed bugs. And never use any homemade chemicals. These can be very harmful to your family. Controlling bed bugs requires creating a clean zone. This means emptying and thoroughly cleaning one part of one room. This is your clean zone. Then treat and move items and furniture into this clean zone. This way, the clean zone expands as the room is completed. Working carefully will ensure that very little is missed. Repeat this process on each room of your home. Every room must be treated. You can kill bed bugs by hand if you find them while treating your home. First, get them out into the open by using a stiff plastic card, like an old credit card or something like that. Slide it into cracks and crevices and push any bugs out. Use a flashlight so you can see them. Kill them by crushing them one at a time or use sticky tape to capture them. Dispose of the bed bugs in a sealed plastic bag. Then use hot soapy water to wipe up any extra bugs, blood stains, eggs, and shed skins. If you have a vacuum cleaner, this can quickly capture and remove bed bugs. Vacuum crevices around baseboards, electronics, and other places where bed bugs might be hiding. If your vacuum cleaner stores waste in a removable bag, remove it right away, seal it in plastic, and dispose of it in an outside trash container. If it uses a canister, empty the waste right away into a plastic bag and seal it. Whether bag or canister, check your vacuum cleaner for any remaining bugs and kill them. Washing clothes and linens can also be very effective in controlling bed bugs. The key is using high temperatures for both water during washing and the air during drying. You can also use a freezer to kill bed bugs. If items can be safely frozen, put them in the freezer for at least four days at zero degrees Fahrenheit or colder. Anything warmer than this, or for a shorter time, will not kill all the bed bugs. Mattress encasements that are designed specifically to control bed bugs are also very effective. They take some time to kill off existing bed bugs, but they do work. Also, applying tape around the legs of your bed with the sticky side out can trap bed bugs before they get to your bed. Thank you for taking the time to learn about bed bugs and how to control them. Keeping our family safe is important. We can't ignore this problem, and we shouldn't be too embarrassed to deal with it properly. Thanks for watching and stay safe.